an 18-year-old whiz kid from Mexico trying to make it in the U.S. That means handling more powerful cars than he's used to and conquering super fast tracks. For his second ARCA race at the Michigan International Speedway, Juan Carlos Bloom is guaranteed a spot because there are only 34 cars. The qualifying runs will determine starting positions. La última vuelta, la cita perfecta, okay? Juan Carlos's mentor, Armando Fitz, knows that on this two mile track, drivers routinely hit 200 miles an hour. This is first time to ever qualify in any, any speeds like this. I mean, he's running 50 miles an hour faster than he's ever run. His mother is here and his sister to offer support, but they have a bad case of the jitters. Crazy, nervous, everything. <laughs> her and her mother are about to throw up. Carl Long, the spotter, offers advice. Look ahead and aim. Aim for the bottom of the start finish line and it'll come right back up. El todo or nada en esa pista. For me, it's all or nothing on this track. His first qualifying lap is good, but not great. What did he run? 180. He's three miles off of yesterday. Nerves. Nerves. The second lap is better. Baja, 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 baja. Hey, he got the eight. He picked it up. He got the eight. <gasps> the speed was 183.6 miles an hour. Else went out. Eight? Yeah. Awesome. Hey, I'm when the other drivers have all run their qualifying laps, Juan Carlos is bumped back to the 13th position. But that's far better than 30th at his previous race. Good job, young man. He just was not used to the speed. He says when he hit the daggum gas, it just, and he dropped it to the bottom, it was just, it went there. It went. Juan Carlos has done well enough qualifying to start the race with a decent position. 13th is not bad for a rookie, but he's got a lot to learn and he is nervous. Have fun. Green flag goes in the air, we're underway. Butterflies and all, Juan Carlos starts out running a smart race. But can he stay smart for 200 grueling miles 